Okay, guys and gals and people out there watching this, I want to show you something that is way cool. It's beyond cool, actually. Well, if you're an anorak, an amateur radio operator, what this is is SDR. Basically, that stands for Software Defined Radio. And to really put it in its very basic terms, it's um, um, what they're doing in this instance is broadcasting a remote station over the internet. Um, so this particular station is set up in the United States, W4MQ. That's over in the States somewhere. And, and, we can, and you can access this, anyone can access this from anywhere in the world. And you can listen to, at the moment, this guy's got, he's got top band 40 meters and 20 meters set up and you can basically listen to what is coming through on his radio now what I'll do is I'll just turn the uh, speakers on so you can uh, you can hear exactly what's going on so I'm trying not to knock my camera over I've done that before I'll be crying out loud you have to forgive me bloody wheelchair users pain in the ass right Turn the um right there we are there we are right here we are this is his radio so if we were in the United States in this guy's shack we're basically listening to his radio here um, I think he's using a vertical so we can go along the band and these this is like what they call a waterfall and these little specks here are all signals coming in. Where, where there's nothing, there's no signal. So if we click here, like that, oh, sorry, under, underneath there. Right, there's someone there, and if we just use these little buttons over here, just to tune it in, try and tune the signal in. There you go. Right, down here is a signal. This guy is obviously in the States. I don't know who he's talking to. I think he's talking to someone within the States. But you can see it's a very, very strong signal down here. So, let's have a listen to someone else. This is, an, this is another station here on 14180. Not so strong. So let's have a listen. So once again, we'll use the down ones. See if we can tune them in. There we go. There we go. There we go. Now remember, I'm in the United Kingdom. I'm I'm not using my radio. This I'm accessing this website. Um, it's www.w4mq.com. Um, anyone can access this, and anyone can listen to uh, amateur radio stations. So I'm listening to a remote station in the state in the United States. So there's someone else having a chat. Let's turn it up a bit. Right. You can't hear the person who he's talking to at the moment. Let's have a go up here. Let's listen here. Someone else here. It's a nice strong signal. Let's go down the band a bit. He's 20 over 9. He's got a lower power, uh, right. now, board diode, actually a rectifier board uh, in the... This turns the down. That goes with the lower power I want to show you something that is really, I think, is, is absolutely brilliant. Let's go and find a clear frequency. Uh, let's go to, uh, let's go to, um, 230, no, we won't go to it's Let's try, uh, there, that's pretty clear. All right, we'll go here. Well, there is a very weak station, so we won't go there. We'll go here instead. Right, we're on 14206. That appears to be fairly fairly clear, although the guy who's got the remote, sta remote station has got quite a s strong noise level. I think he's using a vertical, and they always pick up a lot of noise. S6. 
Right, now this is what I'm going to show you, and this is what I really like. I'm going to go over to my radio, which is behind me. I'll just turn this up, I hope you can hear me. I'm going to go over to my radio. I've already got my antenna pointing towards the States. Right? And I'm going I'm to tune to 2.06. At the moment, I am on my radio. My radio is tuned to the frequency that we're listening to on this remote station. Now, I'm going to just do a little test call and um, listen very carefully. Uh, testing, testing. This is Golf Zero Victor Quebec Yankee. Golf Zero Victor Quebec Yankee. G Zero VQI doing a test call. The Tesco is coming by. Right. I don't know if you can hear that. But I can hear my voice coming through my computer. So I know now that propagation is, is going from the UK to the States. So I know that people will be able to hear me in the States. I didn't look, but I'll just check again to see what my signal was over there. So, I'll try again. You just keep a keep a little look on the on the signal meter. So we do it again. This is Golf Zero Victor Quebec Yankee. Golf Zero Victor Quebec Yankee. G Zero VQY. Right. I reckon I'm about five and eight. No, about five and seven. I'm about five and seven. Well, let's just turn that down a bit. So I don't know. I hope this comes out. I hope you can hear. You could hear exactly what was going on there. But um, basically, just to um, tell you again what this is. This is um, a remote station set up remotely um, using STR software-defined radio. So you've got a, a little um, receiver or and a transmitter attached to um, a remote aerial that's attached to a computer and it's transmitting what's showing showing us what he's receiving and I think that's uh, pretty goddamn cool and it just means that there's lots of these there's lots of them in the States there's, there's quite a few in Europe as well and, and lots of them cover all different frequencies from top band right up to uh, right up to a microwave and two meters and what have you and it just means that you can go on there and basically you know if you've even if, you, if you're not with your radio and you've got a PC, you can have a listen to the amateur radio bands. Or if, if you want to check the propagation and see if you are, um, you know, see if you can be heard, you can do what I've just done. Go on there, put a test call out and see if you can hear yourself. I can hear myself. So I'm going to go on the radio in a minute, put a few CQ, CQ calls out. And uh, if all goes alright, someone should come back to me from the States. Because I know I'm being heard over there. So uh, I hope that uh, is all pretty clear uh, about uh, SDR, Software Defined Radio.